I have a long history of being involved in studying places in space and time where the physics goes really badly wrong and these are called singularities of space-time. They include, of course, black holes, so things go very badly wrong at the centre of black holes. We have infinite curvature. It also includes the singularity at the start of the universe, for instance. So a lot of my work has been in understanding those types of singularities. This has involved a study of gravitational waves as well. The first detection of gravitational waves was an amazing event for everyone involved. We'd worked for it for a very long time and we knew that the detectors were reaching a sensitivity where we could expect now to detect an event. But still, to have one come in so quickly and so clearly, that was a defining moment for all of us in science. It was incredible. What we're going to do now is open this window on gravitational wave astronomy and all sorts of things are going to be discovered. One of the great hopes is that we will inspire a new generation of young scientists, male and also, and perhaps particularly female scientists, um, to, to come into the world of physics and be involved in these projects and eventually make major contributions of their own.